happy Sunday, everybody. Let's go get straight to the word of God. Hold up. Let's go get straight to the word of God. Let's read this one. Y'all can pause it. Y'all can read it. Father, read it to y'all. Jesus said, Knock and I will open the door. Ask and you will receive from what am I asking for? Do I really need more new things or do I need Jesus to come into my heart and make everything new? I love that story. It's because Jesus says, ask and you will receive. But he's like, do I really need it or do I just want it? Or do I want Jesus to come into my heart? That's what y'all need to ask yourself every single day. Do y'all need it? Or y'all need to ask God for Jesus to come right in your heart? We got... Oh, yeah. Tomorrow's the first day of school. So, yeah. I'm going to try to do a vlog for the first day of school, but... Um, this is a church. This is a vlog. It is a YouTube station in this YouTube. This says, who said that I will pray God will show me what to do. I know his voice. I hear him in my heart. I see him all around me. He will speak to me. And when he does, I list, will listen. Right here. She said, Jesus talks to her in her heart. She hears you. She said, when Jesus calls on her, she will listen to Jesus. This is what we got to do. We got to listen to Jesus. Listen to Jesus. Read your Bible. Spread the word. That's how you get to heaven. Uh, my is this right here, right here, right here. I love this because I just love spreading the word. Jesus. I, I'm going to keep on saying this and saying this in every video I make. Jesus is coming back. And he's going to be taking the people who spread his word. And lastly, is a child of God. And the devil is going to take y'all to hell. The people who don't fly with God. Once y'all hear those trumpets, y'all better be prepared if y'all gonna go to heaven or hell. I saw this video. I'm not trying to throw no shade. Well, rappers don't go to heaven. Cardi B, who talks about all this stuff, you can listen to it, but people say, Everybody a Christian, everybody Christian says, every Christian says, rap music is the devil word. I saw Tupac, I saw, I, I just keep scrolling on TikTok, Tupac, Biggie, Elvis, I heard they was in hell. Tupac, he was cut in pieces like he was fresh devil. The devil angels, like, I don't know what the, the demon, the devil demon, they'll walk past him. They walk, they'll walk past Tupac. They walk past Tupac. They, 
first they didn't do nothing. Then they would run back to him. And they would, they would just do bad things to him. They would terminate him. Like I said, white people said, I think it's in the, it's in the Bible. They say, when you go to hell, the devil and the demons, they're going to rape you. They're going to abuse you. They're going to hit you. All the things you don't want to do. We don't know if they were going to, we don't know if they was raping you. We don't know if they was abusing. All we know is the person said he was Tupac was screaming for help. All he, all the person asked is ask for two. Ask he asked where is Tupac. He he asked where is Tupac. He went to sleep. He went to hell. He went to sleep. He saw everybody in hell. He saw Biggie. Big kids in hell. Elvis is in hell. Michael Jackson is in Yeah, Michael Jackson is in Michael Jackson is in hell. S.S. and Tasha is in hell. King Von is in hell. S.S. and Tasha is in hell. Every, all of those rappers are in hell. Then, you know... It's not like people think God just like God. People say they God just like send people to hell, but he don't. Cause a lot of celebrity goes to heaven. It's just not the celebrity you think are in heaven. Like Kobe Bryant, he's in his personal hell. Everybody got a hell. A personal hell. Tupac, he was in a museum, a museum where they put his, where they put his pictures. But it wasn't his pictures; it was his body parts. They just cut everything off Tupac, and they put him there. Y'all don't want to go to hell for the rest of y'all life, don't y'all? Y'all know that's gonna be once you die. Once you die. You can't come back to life. Once you die, you can't go to your body. Once you die, you're dead and you're not coming back to this earth again. Once you die, you're going to go to heaven or hell. If you go to hell, you're going to stay there for eternity. I don't know. It's kind of weird because I, I always think about this. People go to hell. People go to heaven. How long will the earth take? Till the earth is all gone. Cause y'all are gonna spend your whole life, every life, hell or heaven. This is like you're like when are we gonna get a new place? Like it's just confusing. It's like it's like crazy because it's like you got so much questions to ask God and y'all can ask God. These questions, y'all can ask Jesus these questions, but y'all just don't ask them these questions. Y'all like to say, I'm, I can do whatever I want today, and I will be here tomorrow. I can do whatever I want today, but I'm going to be here tomorrow to do that stuff. So I'm going to be here tomorrow to ask God for forgiveness. I will be here tomorrow. To tell sorry to my mom, my dad, my family members, everybody who I upset. I won't be here tomorrow. We don't know if we're gonna be here tomorrow. We don't know if we're gonna be growing up. Cause you know SS and Tasha, you you know two parts of code, you know Biggie, you know Kiva, you know Cosmo. They died at the nearest 20, 24. You know I forgot his name, but a football player died in his 80s. That's crazy, because he, he probably thought he was going to be here tomorrow, but he passed away. These people got shot. They probably passed away. They probably juice a little pass away. We don't know. They all passed away. Today is Sunday. And I swear it work because it's Sunday church, is it? And it's just, it's just the day 
supposed to spread the word. It doesn't take that long to watch half of this video. Half of video. You can search up church. You can search up how to get to heaven. How you can search up how to give your crew. How to give your life to God. And you can watch half of the video. You can stop. You can do whatever you want. Then you can go back and watch the rest of the video. It is not that hard to pick up a Bible and read a scripture. It is not that hard to read a scripture in the Bible. Like, I'm going to read this one. That, what will God give me when I learn to have faith? What will he do when I trust in his word? God will give me his self. He will make me his own. He will set me free. God will set you free. He will give you your own if you just put your trust in Jesus. If you put your trust in God, they will give you their all. If you give Jesus, God, your your all, they will give you their all. I'm going to be one more scripture on God as y'all carry on. Up y'all day. One more scripture will say. Sometimes I don't like to be alone. I feel lonely, but when I am low, every day is quick. I can talk to God. If I listen, baby, I will hear his answer. He said he didn't like to be alone. But he said if he's alone, he can talk to God. And that's good. Y'all can be alone. Y'all can be bored. Y'all can just talk to God. That's all y'all got to do is talk to God. But, okay. <laughs> And I'm going to get out y'all way. Y'all can do whatever y'all want. That's what y'all to spread the word. And I want to pray for y'all before we get out. Father God, whatever they're going, whatever they do, I want you to bless them. I want you to follow them everywhere they go. All the kids who's going back to school, all the grandmas who's going to college, all the, all the high schools, all the middle schoolers, all the elementary schoolers, I want you to put, I want you to put, I want you to protect them when they go to school. I want you to protect them, Lord God. I want their God and angels to protect them because you know a lot of school shootings be happening. God, in Jesus' name, amen. Alright, bye guys.